Ghost's evolution through the shades of nostalgic metal has been remarkable to say the least, with humble beginnings emerging from the lurching fog of old school doom metal, the band have navigated a musical history pinching inspirations from heavy metal, Scandinavian pop and psychedelic rock. Led by the outfit's brainchild Tobias Forge, this fifth full length Impera strides forth boldly off the back of Prequel's arena rock encroachment. Fully embracing American rock vibes of the 70s, they dazzle once again with a little touch of glam rock echoing in the passing winds. On the first few spins, it all felt so obvious. Kassarian's intro baked by sun-soaked guitar leads, an ascending falsetto yell, and the epic build to crunching hard rock riffs felt like a page out of someone else's book. But who? Spillways' piercing piano chops and Tobias' vocal line again echo some creative genius of the past. It goes on throughout the album. Queen, Led Zeppelin, Van Halen, Boston, Dio. These songs continuously evoke the emotive rumble of classic rock anthems, yet not once do ghosts plagiarise. As more repetitions sunk in, I couldn't deny how fantastically written these songs are. Even the initially disappointing Hunter's Moon finds its place in the track listing. The album swoons through one vibe after another. Tobias's impeccable singing, both in pitch and persuasion, is accompanied by a fine and expansive set of instruments. These arrangements have their key distinctions glistening in the forefront with a lush backdrop of soft synths, organs and glittering acoustic guitars. The whole affair is a slick and dynamic groove adapting to a song's purpose. Instruments drop in and out to perfectly complement one another when it is apt to do so. The variety here is stunning. Most songs pivot off the arena rock vibes with detours into power ballads and the like. The one true metal song that hails back to Opus Eponymous, 20s, suffers its own stiffness. Led in by a dramatic break in tone, Dominion's gruelling trumpet orchestration bluntly pivots out of the utterly anthemic Watcher in the Sky. The metallic lurching riff and ghoulish key tones set a stage for Tobias's creepy groans, but the chorus is woeful and garish. All too kitsch for my taste. Other than that one blemish, Impera is a mostly flawless embark further into the depths of musical history. Knowing this is their angle now made me initially sceptical, but the pure class of songwriting is undeniable. Every song is flush with sing-along hooks, stunning melodies and memorable guitar leads. It got me excited for where they might venture next, but as of now it's another quality collection of songs to enjoy for the coming months and years. Ghosts have more than proven themselves as legends. Thanks for listening. If you'd like to see some more of my music blogs, go check the website out and be sure to subscribe to catch the next upload.